I was letting y'all know I'm opening up a plumbing business. I had to put a new sink in because the housing was leaking. So I had to take everything off the wall. I can only get one screw and a stud so on this side. So this side, I'm really hoping the silicone sticks and uh, I don't have to worry about it anymore. But anyway, I'm for hire. That's kind of work I do. Just a little tape just to keep it in place. So I bought a chuck steak to, I was going to put in the crock pot, but I decided just to grill it. I don't know how that will turn out, but look at this big sucker. That's a regular size plate and it covers most of it. Not sure how healthy it is because there's a lot of fat in there. But for a guy on a budget, $7, that's going to be at least two mils. I'll probably get some to Rhody because she almost got bit by a dog today. Had to kick it. Well, guess what? Now this is happening. Excuse me. Excuse me. What are you doing? Had to kick it twice. And it was with a neighbor that came up to me about a week ago talking about me using my drone. So that was awesome. The dog is okay. My foot's okay. And so is Rody. Just a man on a budget trying to eat a steak. Let's do this. Voila, still takes up the whole plate, the flower plate. I'm a man. The next day. Welcome to video module number eight. How to use social media. There are four key areas I'm gonna cover in this module. Just remember this, when you're at your job and you have to do that stupid training class, it doesn't go away when you try to start your own business. Back to the grind. I'm gonna go ride my bike with some tunes and I'll be honest with you I worked out yesterday you know where the weight room is and I'm very sore and I for, forgot to thaw out some food to cook tonight so I'm probably gonna go get a sandwich and a coke today but you got to reward yourself for working out this is the first time I lifted weights at a gym in a long time. It was Gold's Gym was the last time I did that. It was way back in the day. So I'm feeling it today. So I'm gonna ride my bike and use my new, um, get me like a new little GoPro type thing. So I'm gonna see how that does, just for fun. So here we go. hurry it's not gonna last here's just something funny so that whole time I was pumping up my back tire my front tire went completely flat that's in my face 
I can only imagine it was when I was on that busy night street and I had to go through the downhill hills. So I gotta walk about a quarter of a mile back to my house, maybe a half a mile. That's in my face. As you can see, my tire is way flat. That was the one I wasn't even pumping up. I don't know how that got flat all of a sudden when I started pumping up my back wheel or back tire. This one's flat again already. Can you lick that hole up? Appreciate it. That's what she said, by the way. <laughs> I still got a good ride in though. Gives me something to do on Sunday. Uh, let's talk about regrets. Regrets can come in all shapes and forms. Maybe you ate the Big Mac instead of getting the chicken sandwich. Maybe you married somebody that you shouldn't. But today, it's not about those regrets. It's about waking up in the morning, first thing, and deciding to trim up your beard without even really thinking about it. That's what I did today. I've been trimming my beard all week, just kind of nickel and diamond it so I don't mess it up. Well, today, I messed it up. If you can tell, this part is a different length than this part. And I don't know what I was thinking. I wasn't. This might, you might not be able to see it, but trust me. If you can see it, it looks goofy. And the only thing you can do with regrets is move forward. So I guess I'm gonna have to... I wish all my regrets were that easy to fix. I'm trying to do these... Whoa, man. I look like a little high schooler. <laughs> oh, that's gonna take some getting used to. So I accidentally did something. Oh yeah. I know, I know. Apparently I'm not the only person who wanted McAllister's tonight. I'm starving. How's it going? Doing good. I had a call in for Eric. For Eric? Yes. Thanks, man. Uh -huh. Have a good, good night. I still think $11 for a sandwich, mac and cheese, and a drink is ridiculous. But, man, is it good. And I'm about to kill it. I'm weak. What do you want me to say? All right. I'm about to take the first drink of a soda. Uh, it's been a while. I don't know. But it's. I'm very excited. So excited. That let's put the hat backwards and let's take a drink. <laughs> Man, I wish I did not like those things. Say when. Say when.